Hey, what's up everyone, Richard here, and today we'll be taking a look at one of the coolest features included in the new gauge shotgun pack. That is the ability to select different ammo types for your shotguns. With this addition, you can tweak individual shotguns to have different ammo, allowing them to fit specialized roles. In game, there are five separate types of shotgun ammunition. Double op buckshot, triple op buckshot, flechette, armor piercing slugs, and high explosive. Each type of ammo affects the shotgun in different ways, allowing them to either be used for more broad circumstances or for more specialized combat. First we will look at the default ammo for all shotguns, double op buck. Essentially just a hail of medium sized ball bearings, double op buck will not harm your accuracy or ammo supply. However, it will not grant any special bonuses such as additional penetration. But double op buck is a tried and true ammunition type and serves well in dealing with large groups of police units at close range. If you don't feel any other ammo types fit your playstyle, going vanilla might be the best option. Second up is the big brother of the standard ammunition. With considerably increased lethality comes triple op buckshot. Like double op buck, triple op fires ball bearings. However, they are much larger than its predecessor, allowing it to rend through flesh and pulverize ballistic protection. Loading your shotgun with triple op buck will change the weapon in two separate ways. It will increase damage by 25% of its pre-mod and pre-skill rating, of course. Second, it will reduce your total ammo pool by roughly 30%. The increased damage will, however, make each round much more efficient at slaying your foes. But accuracy and shot placement is essential, so aiming for the head and waiting for opponents to close on you may be your best option when using this ammo type. Triple Op Buckshot works very well with any of these shotguns. However, the low damage shotguns may see the greatest benefit from the ammo type. Next up is a high tech solution to an age old problem, flechettes, which seek to increase the range and penetration of shotguns while retaining most of its lethality. When flechettes are selected, you will see a slight drop in damage, but an increase in range and the ability to penetrate the vests of max force responders. To be more specific, flechettes will reduce your unmounted damage by a noticeable 20%. However, all shotguns will see their accuracy increase by 4 and their maximum falloff range increase by 35%. This means damage decay will be much less steep, allowing for more consistent performance across range. Flechettes are fine with most shotguns, but high damage shotguns will be able to take advantage of this the most, being able to smite opponents from greater distances. Our next ammo type, the Armor Piercing Slug, comes with a few more surprises. The AP Slug is similar to Sabo rounds used in main battle tanks, although considerably smaller. These rounds gain a little extra weight in exchange for unparalleled stopping power. AP Slugs have a complex effect on shotgun performance, most noticeably increasing damage by 25%. In addition, the Slug can also pass through armor, shields, and even cover, However, damage will be reduced by 75% after doing so, but the increased flexibility is critical in many situations. The trade-off is quite heavy, however, as your total ammo pool will be cut in half, meaning good control and accuracy are paramount to using the slug ammunition. While slug's effectiveness can vary player to player, I find myself using them in secondary shotguns as a quick way to dispatch of shields. Now, we come to our explosive finale, taking on the HE shells. Unlike any other shotgun shell previously mentioned, HE rounds are often fin stabilized rounds designed to be targeted against material objects rather than living ones. However, they work well against either one, as long as you don't mind getting charged with a war crime. Collecting the high explosive shells will make your shotgun shells detonate on impact, with a blast radius slightly smaller than a meter. These explosions will stun anything but cloakers in addition to causing damage. As cool as they sound, HE rounds cannot score headshots and player's ammo pool will be reduced by 65%. In addition, accuracy is reduced by 6, making this suited for close range stun locking. Oddly enough however, these rounds do not expire and will travel on until hitting a target, allowing you to soften up enemy units before coming into contact with them. HE shells work great with automatic shotguns, being able to almost instantly strip away the armor of a bulldozer or soften up a whole SWAT element. Thanks to our friend Gage, shotguns have a whole new take on life. 
being able to tackle a wide set of situations now with specialized ammunition. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this, feel free to like or subscribe. Or if you have any questions, feel free to ask me in the comments or on Twitter. Once again, my name is Richard. Peace out.